frustrating you guys with some great saves along the way. Yeah, Hell Hellebuck uh, looked like a sumo wrestler in the net um, with with athleticism. I mean, he was good. He was he was big and solid, and uh, uh, we did have enough. Uh, opportunity um, right down to that last one when they got their game-winning goal. We had two opportunities actually at, on that. So uh, it looked like we, you know, it didn't look like, but we had a perfect chance to go up three to two, and within ten seconds. And we know how that happens sometimes, and it happened tonight. Like you said, it seemed like you got back to your usual offensive self as far as creating the aggressiveness. Do you, do you think that was that came back tonight? Yeah, that was a really important really important factor for us tonight was to get to our game, play a higher tempo, higher pace game. Uh, I thought they played with a lot of intent to try to deny that, to deny that high pace game, even though they're a very high pace team. Uh, they, they were aggressive defensively. They try, you know, they clogged the neutral zone up really well. Uh, you know, we had to work hard to, to, to get our ice and create our ice. And I thought our guys did a Nice job to do that, and, and got some volume of, of opportunity at uh, Hellebuck, and you know he was good. He rose, and th that was he was their best player tonight. And uh, on the on the flip side, you know Oopy didn't have as much work uh, as that, but Oopy was also very good, and, and his body language was great. He 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 looked confident. He read read things well, and um, I was happy to see that for him um, as well. What has made the Joe's line as effective as it's been? Last few games here. Uh, lots of determination prior. I mean, they've worked hard uh, to to break through and, and actually find ways to feel good about their game. And um, you can see now they ha there's a whole other level of confidence to them, which means they're feeling much better. They're in sync. They're uh, they've they've been a, they constantly communicate. The three of those guys, uh, every rush and rep in practice. Um, every shift back on the bench and you see we've seen that we've seen the, their relationships the three of them grow um to the point they they uh have been very effective for us the last two games especially could you have gotten did you feel you got enough traffic did you see too many of the shots i mean you can always get more paul especially if you haven't if you if you're down a goal and the scoreboard runs out the time runs out but um you know, we had we had chances. We had chances to score. I, I think, um, you know, for you're always going to have regrets post game. Always, um, you can go in any of them. Did, we, did you get enough traffic? I uh, didn't. You know, I know our power play guys aren't going to like that. You know, their performance tonight. So, you know, when you when you lose by a goal, yeah, there's many things. Could we get through neutral zone cleaner and better, more transition? Could we come out of the corner better? Could we? Uh, you know, broken out a little smoother and, and, and slung it a little more. Uh, so, you know, there's there's lots of things, and you would add, uh, like you would any night you don't win, uh, did we need more net front. So 